Yakte Susat, good morning, Saka. Coming from Katahini, Glacier Bay, Alaska. Bartlett Cove, coming in to Bartlett Cove. I'm here in the state room, uh, first floor. And we're going to be docking here shortly, real soon. This is my last cruise here for the, this season. So the, a lot of passengers will get off uh, um, here and then do a little walking, they have a little walking trail hike that they can go around. Take a look at uh, what Glacier Bay has to offer. We spent uh, yesterday and all that up in, uh, going up into the bay all the way to the end, end of the bay. Well, Marjorie Glacier or Sitka Clean is at, came back down, spent the night, um, and now we're had breakfast this morning and coming in. And this is where I will end up um, getting off after all the the passengers that want to go on the hike, um, go explore a little bit, spend a little bit of time, a few hours here in uh, in uh, Bartlett Cove before they head on their way to Wrangell and Petersburg. I mentioned to them that down in Petersburg, that was a totem pole that I carved that. Got, was raised and uh, unveiled there the 5th of July of this uh, just this year the newest totem pole in Petersburg so but I love Southeast Alaska I like that so the big cruise ships don't come in here They're, we go out and we meet the, they have a boat called the Chirac no catamaran that takes us out. And, uh, to meet the boats. So here we are approaching. Coming up to the dock, it's, uh, first come, first serve. So, looks like we. We don't have other visitors at the dock yet, uh, parked there. And if that's the case, we're able to pull right on up and tie rope off and yeah, easy uh, way to get off and go. I saw one time where the, um, here in the summer where uh, many boats were already sell boats and other kind of boats are tied up to the dock so this boat here had to park out here into the into the cove a little bit and then they had to tender everybody in but from where I'm at right now it looks like um, we're gonna be able to just pull up and dock where we want to There's a ramp. So it's high tide. So there's like a 25 foot tide swing here. And we're definitely high tide because that that uh, ramp there can have a pretty steep pitch when it's low tide. Going to be a pretty nice day so far. Looks like the weather's holding, which is good. Makes it uh, easier or uh, more joyful for the passengers as they get off and go explore uh, Bartlett Cove, Atihini. Yeah.
shut the video off now. And uh, maybe I'll wait a little bit. Because right now they're going to put their bow thrusters on. And push you sideways up to the dock. And it takes them a little bit. Because once they tie off, then they have to open up. Then they put out their their ramps and everything else that they need to, for the passengers to load on this specific uh, ship. There's a lot of uh, uh, senior citizens on here. There's the Welcome to Glacier Bay Parks, National Park sign, Glacier Bay, Tigai Huam, my ancestral, ancestral homeland, Bartlett Cove, Atehini. A lot of those boats that are parked on the other side of the dock, they're part of the park service. There's a lot of research vessels that they have there. Um, there's uh, some that are part of the, like a patrol, police patrol kind of thing. So all the way up there, top up here, there's a totem pole up there. It's called the healing pole. Talks about the the dichotomy, the uh, the differences between the Hunashliget and the Park Service, and how they're trying to make uh, build more bridges uh, between the two uh, groups and try to make things work work out. And well, I never noticed this down here before. The three hour limit for parking a lot of boats that come in so and at this place here they this is usually where the uh, this boat here will um, also take on water from right over there and top off the water tanks as before they head on out to wrangle So most of the time I'm getting my bags and getting ready to disembark, but I usually wait until after all those that are getting off that want to go for the day hike and I say goodbye to them. And uh, But I thought, well, since this is my last time here uh, this season, I'll go ahead and make this video of us pulling up to the dock. So they're using their bow thrusters uh, Push us up to the side. Nice, the water's nice and calm today. Like I said, you can see that ramp. Oh, uh, it's high tide, yeah. So way over there is a boat launch. And then a little bridge that comes out, looks like a breakwater over on that side like that. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut off the camera. Go over to the outside here, over to the, where they're gonna be putting the ramp and the door where people will be disembarking here. And I'll get a little video from there. All right, feels good to be back. It's been a great time out here. Enjoyed the season. This is one of my best boats to be on because it's small and and um, get to get go to around different areas and explore get in closer to areas where the big big ships can't so uh okay